Hi, I'm Chad with Move 4 Guitar. In this lesson, I'm going to show you how to play drop 3, minor 7 chord inversions, starting on the 5th string. So in this lesson, I'm going to show you drop 3, minor 7 chord inversions, starting on the 5th string, like I said. And I'm not going to dive into the theory or what drop three chords are or inversions or anything like that. This lesson I want to be a pretty quick lesson that you can use to learn these chords and shapes really quickly and use it as a reference if you need. If you need more explanation on the actual theory of inversions and what a drop three chord is, I'll be doing lessons on that that actually dive into the theory. But like I said, for this lesson I want to keep it simple. I'm just going to play these for you have the diagrams on the screen and so that you can quickly learn these and get them under your fingers. And in this lesson I'm going to show you in C minor. So I'm going to show you C minor 7s starting in root position and go all the way up to third inversion. And I'm just doing C minor because it falls on a nice place on the neck. I can play it down here and I have room to go all the way up to third inversion. But these shapes work in any key so once you get it down to C minor, you want to move it to other keys and practice it as well. They'll, all the distances will be the same, it's just you have to start in a different place and end in a different place on the neck. And also, when I show the diagrams on the screen, I'm not going to show the fingerings. If you're taking this lesson, you should be pretty good at learning chords because these are more advanced. You should already know how to find what fingerings work best for you. A lot of people finger chords differently. And also, a lot of chords have multiple options for fingering, so it just depends on the playing situation. It also depends on the player's hands and what's going to be most comfortable and what they can grab the quickest. So when I show the diagrams, it's going to have the intervals on the screen, not the fingers. So I'm just going to start with C minor 7 in root position. So those are drop three minor seven chords starting on the fifth string and like I said I was showing you C minor sevens. Practice those up and down the neck starting in root position all the way to third inversion. Practice them going up and then back down. Once you have that down, mix up the order and just randomize it and that will ensure that you don't build muscle memory as far as building muscle memory and only being able to play them by muscle memory. You need to be able to visualize these and grab them quickly no matter what playing situation you're in or no matter what key you're in. And that's also what you want to do once you get these down in C minor, move them to the other key so that you're able to play them in any key, in any key, anytime you want. And be sure to subscribe because we add at least one new lesson every day.